Hey what was going on guys welcome back to my channel and in today's video I'm going to be showing you an insane 125k squad builder on FIFA 16 in this 4-3-2-1 formation. So starting off in goal I've gone with Gianelli Buffon and this goalkeeper is absolutely amazing. As you can see here 85 diving, 83 reflexes, really good stats, 89 positioning, 79 handling and 71 kicking. So a lot of stats in the 70s and 80s and for like 2k this guy is absolutely amazing. He's 6 foot 3 so a very tall goalkeeper which helps loads and overall he's an absolute beast in goal. I'm moving on to centre back. On the right hand side I've gone with Otamendi, very overpowered defender, um, 75 paces you can see here, 86 defending and 82 physical, so again a very solid player, really good stats this guy has got, he's 6 foot so he's a very tall player um, and as you can see he's an absolute beast, really good stats. Then playing alongside him I've got Barzagli, a very similar player actually, 75 pace, um, 88 defending and 77 physical, so a very solid player, again low high work rate so you know he's just going to sit at the back, he's 6 foot 1 so he's going to win all the headers. And overall, these two players work so well together at centre back. They're very solid players. And then playing alongside them at right back, I've gone with Zabaleta to get those links up because um, they both play for Man City, him and Otamendi. But as you can see, this guy's actually got a really good card, you know, 73 pace and 75 dribbling, so he's not the slowest of players. He's got 85 defending and 83 physical as well as 70 passing, so really good, well rounded stats. He's got a high, high work rate, so he's up and down that right hand side, um, which is ideal because, you know, he's a very good player. He's got really good passing. And overall, an absolute beast at right back. Then moving on to left back player that's a little bit quicker and that is Ansaldi. Uh, as you can see he's got 84 pace, 73 dribbling, 77 defending, 73 physical and 72 passing. So loads of stats in the 70s and 80s and this guy is so so good at left back. I think he's got a team of the season card as well so if you can afford it definitely pick up that card because I think it's very good. Uh, I've only tried it a few times but um, he's got a very good team of the season card. But as you can see high medium work rate so he does get forward a bit. He's left footed, he's got a 4 star weak foot and 3 star skill moves and overall this guy is very good at left back. Then moving on to centre midfield, we've got three very good players. Moving on to the right hand side in centre midfield, as you can see here, I've gone with Costa, a player that you haven't used probably much. Um, he's mostly to get the chemistry up, but he's actually a pretty good player, you know. He's 77 rated, so he's got a pretty low rating, but he's got pretty well rounded stats, you know. He's not the quickest of players with 64 pace. He's got 77 dribbling, 74 shooting, 78 passing, 72 physical, and 66 defending. So most of his stats are in the 70s, and for a player that's like 1k, you know, he's a very cheap player. Um, he's an absolute bargain, definitely pick him up. Um, and it'll get you 10 chemistry with all the players that play around him. And then moving on to centre midfield in the central position, as you can see here, I've gone with Cambiasso, um, his international man of the match card. And honestly, this guy is absolutely phenomenal. As you can see, his stats are just insane. 84 pace, 82 dribbling, so he's so quick, this guy. 88 defending, 84 physical and 84 passing, as well as 74 shooting. So that's sort of stats... Of a player like sort of Team of the Season 9 Golan, he's got very similar stats to this. Um, and Cambiasso is just absolutely amazing. As you can see, his stats, um, his lowest stat is 74, and that's his shooting. And then every single other stat um, is sort of above 80, which is phenomenal. You know, he's got such a good card. He only costs 50k, which is an absolute bargain. And then just stick this guy in centre midfield, and he's going to do a really, really good job. You know, he's left footed, got a medium, medium work rate, so he's just going to sit in the midfield role and do his job. Four star weak foot as well. And overall, this guy is an absolute beast. Definitely pick him up if you can afford him. Then moving on to centre midfield, playing alongside him on that left-hand side, I've gone with Pereira. And this guy is so, so overpowered on FIFA 16. As you can see, 85 pace and 85 dribbling, so he's a very quick player. 71 shooting, 81 passing, 74 defending and 75 physical. So again, another player with really well-rounded stats. You know, his lowest stat is 71, and that is his shooting. He's got a high, high work rate, which is ideal for that centre mid role. He's up and down the pitch. He's 6 foot, so he's a pretty tall player. 4 star weak foot, 4 star skill moves and this guy is an absolute bargain for like 2k. Definitely pick him up, he's an amazing player. Then moving on to left forward in the team. I've gone with a player which I haven't used much on FIFA 16 actually. He's got a um, team of the week card uh, but that's Hanane. 91 pace as you can see here, 83 dribbling, 73 shooting and 75 passing. So he's actually got really good stats, you know, he's only about 20k his team of the week card um, which is an absolute bargain for a player like this because he's very quick as you can see. Um, he's got pretty good shooting and passing as well so overall a very good card, very well rounded stats and does a very good job you know, down that left hand side and also gets that link up with uh, Cambiasso to get him on 10 cam. Now moving on to a striker which I'm sure many of you haven't actually used this guy as striker and that's Danny. He is um, naturally I think he's a centre attacking midfielder as you can see here but if you convert this guy to a striker I think this is his second in form from what I can remember or basically his highest in form and um, try and pick that up but this guy is phenomenal you know he's 85 pace, 86 dribbling, he's so good at striker. 80 shooting, 83 passing, so many stats in the 80s. He's a very fast player, um, which is ideal, works that striker role very well. 
really good shooting and pretty good passing as well which is useful for sort of supplying the left forward and right forward. He's got a high low work rate as well which you know is ideal for a striker which means he can get in behind the defence and work very hard going forward. He's got a 4 star weak foot and 4 star skill moves as well and overall this guy is so good you know his finishing is great, he's a fast player, he's good at passing, he's your all round striker except for his physical obviously which isn't quite as good um, but that doesn't matter at all because this player is very very quick. Then moving on to right forward to finish off the team I've gone with Hulk to get that link up with Danny and this guy is absolutely phenomenal on FIFA 16. As you can see, 85 pace, 82 dribbling, 87 shooting, 81 passing, and 86 physical. Nearly every single stat in the 80, except for his defending, but that doesn't matter, obviously, at all, because he is a right forward. He's not going to be coming back. He's got a high medium work rate, so he's going to be staying forward most of the time. He's left-footed, three-star weak foot, and four-star skill moves. And this guy is just such a beast for, like, 10k, I think. Um, might even be less than that. I haven't really checked his price recently. But as you can see, nearly every stat in the 80... Um, his shooting is phenomenal. He's a very quite fast player, very hard to get off the ball because of his strength and overall an absolute beast. Definitely pick him up if you can afford him. But that's the team for today, guys. A very overpowered strike force, such a good midfield and very overpowered defence as well. Definitely pick up this team if you can afford it. Remember to leave a like on this video, guys, if you enjoyed and subscribe if you're new around here. And I'll see you in the next video.